Alright, so today we're going to talk about the, the reverse arm bar as a reverse or a counter for a regular arm bar. So, if, uh, if, if Sensei Brain and I were in an altercation and I go for an arm bar, I think we, we've done this before, the punches, and I come here, pop, right, I'll go some sort of Seinagi, this just goes from Seinagi here, I grab, Right? And I go to land this arm bar. Now typically, I'll either put both feet here, or I'll put a foot here, and I'll go to land. So I'll put this to my head, and I'll come here, and I'll land. But what happens if, before I go to do that, he pins off, now I go to land this thing, and now I can't. Now I'm stuck. Now I'm kind of here, and now I'm fighting, and now it's pulling, and I'm pulling. And I'm like, like I said, get this. So if you pulled me enough, right, I can just go straight over, pull here, on here, go straight, and just land on the roof, right? And that's the technique. Now, no. As I go to do that, clearly there's a couple of things that are important, right? So I came here, I threw down here, and no, it's not the best throw. We're going to be doing this all day. I don't want to beat the heck out of you. Just know that. As I go to do this, remember, my goal here is to get this up. The untrained person is going to grab, and he's going to try and rotate, and he's going to try and help. So I'm going to get here. The skilled person, as soon as I come here, he's going to shift his weight. So now I come down here. Now all of a sudden, now we're fighting. Okay? Now, the other technique I want to point out, you might be going, it's like, Sensei, why didn't you just rip? I can't just rip, right? So as I come here, and I land it, and I go to get here, well, I don't have to grab like this. Typically what I can do is go deep. And that's typically what I like to do. Instead of giving this up, I just come here, and sit back, and I'll come here, and I'll grab my head, and then, hold on, Brady. You can fight me if you want. See, Brayden's going to hold on to your life, and he's burning a lot of calories. Me, I'm just relaxing, because he can't do this for very long. Now, if I get bored, I go, okay, I'm kind of done with this. I can just push my feet out and just grip and just, oh, he's dead beat. I've got too much force. My legs, two legs are stronger than one of his arms. All right, one more technique. Same principle, different. Different application. I'm in the guard. He attacks, right? And so if he gets here, sometimes this happens, right? He gets here. What does he want to do? He wants to punch, right? And so what you'll notice a lot of times we'll take, we'll push here, right? I'll grab this arm, and I'll come here, and I'll go to get this arm bar like that, right? Which is a good technique. Now, if Braden doesn't pull to that, he goes up the, the, the punch, so it loads up, I come here, he locks off, and he's going, no, you're not going to do that. The same principle, I'm just on the ground. So I do shift my hips and roll, like, roll this way, and now all of a sudden, I'm in the same position. If I want to, I can come with a key lock, or we call it a pump pen alarm bar. But those are some derivations. So if you don't land, the regular arm bar, be ready. Let them win, let them pull you in the reverse arm bar. I'll the reverse arm bar, you just attack nasty.